Have you ever wondered what it's like to visit Dublin, the vibrant capital of Ireland? Picture a city bursting with life, steeped in history and brimming with culture. Dublin, a city where the past and present intermingle in a captivating dance. Here, age-old cobblestone streets echo tales of times gone by, while modern pubs hum with the lively chatter of locals and tourists alike. Dublin is a city that wears its history proudly, with landmarks like the ancient Dublin Castle and the iconic St. Patrick's Cathedral standing as testaments to its rich past. Yet, it's also a city that pulses with a youthful energy, seen in its bustling shopping streets, flourishing arts scene, and renowned universities. From tranquil parks that offer a serene escape to spirited pubs where the Guinness flows freely, Dublin is a city of contrasts, offering a diverse range of experiences for every traveler. So let's dive into the top 10 places you must visit when in Dublin. Buckle up, we're going on an Irish journey. Kicking off our list at number 10 we have Phoenix Park, one of the largest enclosed recreational spaces within any European capital city. This expansive oasis stretches over 700 hectares, providing ample room for both relaxation and exploration. It's not just the size that's impressive, Phoenix Park is home to a thriving ecosystem of diverse wildlife. From the playful red squirrels to the majestic fallow deer, it's a nature lover's paradise. Nestled within the park's leafy confines is the Dublin Zoo, a must-visit for families and animal enthusiasts. With over 400 animals, it's a fantastic opportunity to learn about wildlife from all around the globe. But Phoenix Park isn't just about nature, it's steeped in history too. The park houses the official residence of the President of Ireland, Aras and Uachtarain, a striking feature that adds to its charm. A visit to Phoenix Park promises a blend of nature, history and fun for the whole family. At number 9, we have the Jameson Distillery, the perfect spot for all whiskey enthusiasts. This distillery is steeped in history, dating back to the 18th century when John Jameson first dreamed of creating the world's best whiskey. Today, the distillery stands as a testament to his unwavering dedication to quality and taste. Take a guided tour and stroll through the cobbled stones, where the air is rich with the aroma of maturing whiskey. You'll get to witness the traditional methods of whiskey making, unchanged for hundreds of years. The highlight of course is the tasting experience. From the classic Jameson blend to their signature reserves, each sip offers a journey of flavors, from spicy notes to smooth caramel. And if you're feeling adventurous, why not try a whiskey blending workshop? You'll learn the art of blending and even create your own unique whiskey to take home. So if you're a whiskey connoisseur or just curious, the Jameson Distillery is a must visit. Number 8 on our list is the iconic Temple Bar, the cultural quarter with a lively atmosphere. This vibrant neighborhood is a feast for the senses, brimming with life and energy that's hard to replicate. It's the epicenter of Dublin's nightlife with its pulsating live music and countless pubs and restaurants that are just waiting to serve you a pint of the city's finest. But don't think for a moment that Temple Bar is all about the nightlife. It's also a hub for the arts, with plenty of galleries showcasing local and international talent. The weekend markets are another treat, offering a variety of unique finds, from vintage clothes and handmade jewelry to artisan food and drinks. With its cobbled streets and colorful facades, Temple Bar is not just a place, it's an experience. It's a testament to Dublin's rich cultural heritage and its undying love for good company, good music, and good times. Temple Bar is truly the beating heart of Dublin's social scene. Coming in at number 7, we have Dublin Castle, a journey back in time. This majestic fortress, with its rich history dating back to the 13th century, is a testament to Ireland's past. The castle's architecture, a blend of medieval and Georgian styles, is a sight to behold. Guided tours are available offering an in-depth exploration of the castle's intriguing history and breathtaking interiors. Dublin Castle is a treasure trove of Irish history, not to be missed. At number 6 we find ourselves at Trinity College, home of the legendary Book of Kells. Founded in the 16th century, this esteemed institution is the oldest university in Ireland, boasting a rich history that parallels the nation's own. Its stunning campus, a blend of historic and contemporary architecture, is a testament to the college's enduring legacy and commitment to academic excellence. But among the many treasures of Trinity College, none is more significant than the Book of Kells. This illuminated manuscript, crafted by Celtic monks in the 9th century, is a marvel of medieval artistry. Its intricate designs and vivid colors bring to life the four Gospels of the New Testament, making it a priceless piece of Ireland's religious and cultural heritage. 
Housed in the college's old library, the Book of Kells is a must-see for any visitor. A visit to Trinity College is a walk through Ireland's academic and artistic heritage. If you're enjoying this journey through Dublin, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Your likes help us understand what content you enjoy most, and your comments help us create more engaging and useful videos. So tell us, what's been your favorite spot in Dublin so far? Or perhaps there's a place you're itching to visit. We'd love to hear from you. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more travel guides and tips. Your support helps us bring the world to your screen. Now let's continue our Irish adventure. Number 5 on our list is the hauntingly beautiful Kilmainham Jail. This former prison steeped in history played a pivotal role in the Irish independence movement. Many prominent Irish revolutionaries who dared to dream of an independent Ireland found themselves behind its austere walls. Today the jail offers guided tours, immersing visitors in the stories of political activism, hope, and resilience that echo through its corridors. It stands as a testament to Ireland's tumultuous past. Kilmainham Jail offers a sobering insight into Ireland's past. At number 4, we have the Guinness Storehouse, a must for all beer lovers. This seven-story pint-glass-shaped building is steeped in the rich history of Ireland's most world-renowned stout. Built in the early 18th century, Arthur Guinness signed a lease for a whopping 9,000 years, a testament to his confidence in the brew. In this beer haven, you'll learn all about the brewing process, where the magic behind the dark and creamy stout is revealed. The journey starts with the ingredients. Water, barley, hops, and yeast. You'll discover how these simple elements transform into the iconic Guinness pint. Last but not least, be prepared to indulge in the ultimate tasting experience on the Gravity Bar's top floor. Here you'll be treated to panoramic views of Dublin while savoring a perfectly poured pint of Guinness. And oh that first sip? It's nothing short of sublime. The Guinness Storehouse is a beer lover's paradise offering a taste of Ireland's most iconic brew. Taking the number 3 spot is St. Stephen's Green, a peaceful oasis in the heart of the city. This verdant refuge steeped in history was once a marshy common ground before blossoming into the picturesque park we see today. Adorned with stunning landscapes, it houses fascinating monuments such as the Fusilier's Arch and the Yates Memorial Garden. Whether you're a history buff or a nature lover, St. Stephen's Green is a perfect spot to unwind and soak in Dublin's charm. At number 2 we have Grafton Street, Dublin's premier shopping and entertainment hub. This bustling street is a symphony of sights, sounds, and experiences. It's lined with a variety of shops to satisfy any retail therapy needs. From high-end fashion boutiques to quaint bookshops, there's something for everyone. But shopping isn't the only attraction here. Grafton Street is also renowned for its vibrant street performers. Talented musicians, dynamic artists, and quirky entertainers fill the air with a unique blend of creativity and charm. It's a spectacle you wouldn't want to miss. Nearby, you'll find attractions like the Molly Malone statue. This iconic Dublin figure is a tribute to the fictional fishmonger from the well-known Irish song. A visit to Grafton Street wouldn't be complete without a photo with Molly. In essence, Grafton Street is more than just a street. It's a testament to Dublin's lively spirit, its love for the arts, and its vibrant street life. Grafton Street is where Dublin's energy and creativity truly shine. And finally, at number one we have the Little Museum of Dublin, a charming snapshot of Dublin's past. This quaint museum nestled in the heart of the city is not your typical historical exhibit. Instead, it's a crowd-sourced treasury of artifacts and memorabilia, each piece carrying a unique tale of Dublin's vibrant history. The Little Museum of Dublin's concept is refreshingly simple, yet profoundly captivating. It's a space where everyday objects tell extraordinary stories. From vintage advertisements to personal letters and photographs, the exhibits paint a vivid picture of Dublin's past, as seen through the eyes of its people. What sets this museum apart is its unique storytelling format. It doesn't just display objects, it weaves them into a narrative that's as engaging as it is informative. Guided tours are led by passionate and knowledgeable guides who bring these stories to life, making history feel personal and relatable. The Little Museum of Dublin is a hidden gem that offers a delightful journey through Dublin's history. And there you have it, the top 10 places to visit in Dublin. From the lush greenery of Phoenix Park to the historic Jameson Distillery, the vibrant Temple Bar, the regal Dublin Castle, the scholarly atmosphere of Trinity College, the haunting Kilmainham Jail, the iconic Guinness Storehouse, the tranquil St. Stephen's Green, the bustling Grafton Street, to the charming Little Museum of Dublin. 
Each spot offers a unique slice of Dublin's rich tapestry, so pack your bags and get ready for a memorable Irish adventure. Dublin is waiting for you.